New video today talking about aerodrome finance been a while maybe like a little over a week uh since the last video probably close to 10 days since the last video on aerodrome here 87 cents at the time of this video um holder count right price entire market uh in the red holder count continues to grow 94,762 current holders of aerodrome uh, i've been saying for a while i would not be surprised if we saw 100,000 holders by the end of june uh, here we are here um not even midway through June, we're at 94,000, almost 95,000 holders of Aerodrome. So again, continues to not surprise me at all, just the holder count and where it's continuing to head um, as more and more people find out here about Aerodrome. But obviously there is a uh, red price, right? Aerodrome's down 17% over the last seven days and over the last month. It's down around 6.78%. If we kind of zoom out on the chart, obviously up 850% over the last year. Um, and again, we've seen a ton of price consolidation across the whole market uh, as a whole. We just look at the market in totality, right? Global crypto market cap um, is down a little bit here. It's obviously down 2.62%. And then we just look at other major players in crypto, right? Entire market um, in the red. So it's not like Aerodrome specifically in the red for any given specific news or anything like that. Because again, we talk about Aerodrome and we look at it, it seems that it's you know pretty much in the red right when we talk about i mean it's not in the red pretty much bullish news overall right when we talk about um aerodrome and, and the news that they're putting out and the things that you know one would be positive and, and bullish on when it comes to aerodrome uh there's obviously a lot of things going on with the project that you know many people would be bullish on and that i think people will continue to be bullish on um when they continue to just kind of look at aerodrome and and the type of uh, news that they are putting out right we go to the aerodrome twitter this is really just since over the last few days or so right this isn't even something that has happened or news that has happened you know two weeks ago this is really literally yesterday right uh, coinbase smart wallet is live and this reiterates reasons to remain bullish on aerodrome for myself um it being on top of base and where base goes aerodrome will follow and altcoin season like i've been talking about is going to eventually happen and aerodrome is one of those altcoins in my opinion and not financial advice that i think is going to just reap the benefits of altcoin season but uh, coinbase's smart wallet allows coinbase users to go on chain without needing any app downloads extensions or seed phrases users can now use their coinbase balance on aerodrome watch this simple demo so there's a demo here um, i'll put a link to this tweet in the description below but you can see here, even just with this demo, with Coinbase implementing these sm smart wallets, with the smart wallets now being live, um, I think just resonates with many holders that are bullish on Aerodrome and that are holding for the long term. Um, that Aerodrome riding on top of base is absolutely bullish. I think there's no other reason, not no other reason, but it is the pillar of reasons, in my opinion, to be bullish on Aerodrome, right? Uh, the slipstream is soaring on base. The slipstream has now eclipsed 225 million in volume. This is as of yesterday, so as of two days ago from this video, um, during high volatility, fees are approaching 1.5 million this epoch, or epoch, sorry, 100% go to the VE arrow voters, and then some other launches and things like that going on. Um, again, continues to fly on base. This is just a tweet from nine hours ago. For the last three epochs, aerodrome surpassed 1 billion in volume, and last week it hit 1.24 billion, the second highest ever. Slipstream continues to contribute over 89%. And then 4.29 billion in total rewards, um, as you can see here, for the Aerodrome voting APR of 54.65%, right? So with that alone, I think continues to demonstrate and continues to show why there's reasons to be bullish on Aerodrome, right? Just these updates that we're kind of seeing here, you know, by themselves, right? Just with these updates alone, reasons to be bullish on Aerodrome are clear and obvious in my opinion right and then we just look at a tweet uh like this here from wag me alexander i'll put a link to this tweet in the description below as well if you still don't understand how serious coinbase is about base on a day where we had to pull together some of the largest fund managers in the world brian Armstrong decided to spend his lunch afternoon lunching with a few of us who are building on base right coinbase ceo founder or i don't know if he's the founder actually i could be wrong co-founder and ceo at coinbase brian armstrong um was at the State of Crypto Summit, 
represented by Coinbase and was there talking about building on base, right? Ethereum layer two. And even just this tweet here, which I'll put a link in the description below on this one. Base overtakes OP Bayonet in TBL, becoming largest layer two network in OP stack base super chain, which again includes Optimism, which Optimism has Velodrome, which is a fork of Aerodrome, et cetera, et cetera, right? All of this on top of each other, you guys, to me, constitute a continued bullish outlook, in my opinion. Um, again, this price action not really scaring me at all. It's Aerodrome has and always will be, in my opinion, a long-term play. Let me know in the comments below what you guys feel about Aerodrome. Please drop a like, hit that subscribe button, and as always, have a great day.